I think you become high level by playing a lot, of, a lot of games. You get really experienced by playing a lot of games. A lot of different leaders, a lot of different people. Way back when, when I first started playing the game, the UK Stoner taught me how to play basically everything I know about this game. He's why I'm playing today, basically. He hasn't played in a while, but I think he's one of the best players and they underestimated in this game, but that's basically who taught me. Leader you are, I think as a brute, it's pretty easy to counter because with jackals, your chieftain are better than double barracks. Just all that and all, but the big thing is you don't really want them to let them into your base. Like if you cut off the numbers, even while they're at your base, like you just keep cutting off numbers, you can easily defend it off. And, and as UNSC adding this gunner hogs in, gunner hogs and flamers together are easily just going to rape double barracks no matter if it's marine or flamers. As Anders, just gunner hogs are always a better option than double barracks. And you could also go quick race off a of keep to defend bull barracks. And on Blood River, it's pretty easy because they don't get to your base that fast. You really just have to go jackals to fight for hooks on base. So double haul usually always counters double barracks because you have the chief to. It is very true that Anders Brew is the best combo on Crevice because they're just the best two leaders. But if Kurt gets enough Kenny tanks and wolves, he can base 1v2 as long as your Arbiter stays alive. You really just want to play a real defense and try to get at least one hook with Cutter to get cool tanks to push the Chieftain off. Kirby just kind of wants to linger around defense, play defense on the Brute, and try to catch Warthogs when they attack. And if you wind up getting Power Turret and Wolves and Arbiters, not really much they can do. You just got to defend as much as you can, fight off the first couple pushes, you should be fine.
is very possible. I think it's actually really easy to defend the brute as a yarder just because you go temple, temple third or fourth of the turret, and you can always just build grunts and throw it into the chieftain. Honestly, you have more money because he has to go temple second and rush you or temple first, so you're just going to have a turret, defense, and then, uh, then UNSC is going to help you out eventually. Tell you the truth, Prophet is probably the worst player in the game, but he's useful to play defense and offense. But he's just countered by so many things that you by UNSC like warthogs and tanks just rape him. I mean, he can get air lead and he can do stuff stuff early game, but middle game where the game actually counts, he's really not needed in the game. So I really don't think he's that useful at all. <laughs> I don't really know for that one. I actually run with DCX Factor a lot, a really good Forge in 2v2, and I think Forge is really good for Brute Anders, because it's really hard to get hit. Like, if you hit him, his eco is just so good that it doesn't really affect him. He can get tanks and wolves out, and it counters Brute Anders really well. I think Forge is actually the way to beat Brute Anders.
the best way to get high level is if you play, like, get a two Spartan or just, but you normally play with, just play twos, and if you actually, like, know you're really good and you're both really good, if you beat high level teams, they'll talk about you and they'll actually, like, consider you as high level and eventually they'll apply with you if you're actually good enough. I think since I've been playing 2v2 a lot, I think Cut is probably my favorite leader. Because there's so many different builds you can do, there's so many different ways you can play them. You can go Gosh, you can go Tanks. There's so many different tank builds that you can really, like, not be... Like, people just really can't know what you're doing at all times. Like, and it's just so easy to do, and everybody knows you're going to go Gosh, the same build. I think Cutter is just really original.